we had a patient he was seven year old boy he had a disease which is known as acute myeloid leukemia which is a type of blood cancer after the initial chemotherapy it was decided that he required bone marrow transplant for a possible permanent cure unfortunately he did not have a matched sibling donor in his family so we contacted the international stem cell registry and the registry database showed that he had few matches in germany subsequently the registry contacted the donors and one of the donor was willing to donate stem cells for our patient so we gave our patient high dose chemotherapy which is known as conditioning process and the donor in germany donated his stem cells in a non surgical process just like we donate platelets for patients with dengue so this non surgically collected stem cells were flown in aeroplane to calicut and was delivered to our hospital then we infused these stem cells to our patient without any surgery just like infusing blood product and these stem cells once infused went through the heart into the bone marrow of the patient and it got engrafted that is the bone marrow of the patient got completely transformed to that of our german donor now subsequently the counts that is the wbc platelets and the hemoglobin of that of the patient recovered and the blood of the patient totally got transformed into that of the donor's blood and then he became fit and he was discharged why did we do this bone marrow transplant we develop blood cancers many times in our body it is our immune system which controls that cancer but our patient had a defective immune system because of which he developed the acute myeloid leukemia we wanted to change the immune system to that of a better immune system so we did the bone marrow transplant by which the entire immune system the immune defense mechanism of that of the patient gets transformed to that of a healthy donor this new immune system will keep the cancer in check always unlike chemo which comes and goes the immune system which is newly installed will be there in the body forever of with that of the patient and that will control his cancer why was this transplant even possible this was just because of many good people in the world who were willing to be voluntary stem cell donors the main moral of this story is that all of us between age 18 to 50 years who are fit are potential life savers for many patients who have leukemia or other forms of blood cancers which require bone marrow transplant sitting at the comfort of our home we can register in various stem cell registries which are available in india in worldwide also with the help of just a mobile you can just register with the help of a mobile or using a computer and go to the website and register yourself and they would send you the kit to your home at the required address and you just have to swab yourself in the mouth and self posted uh, envelope you can send back to the registry and they would enter it in their database once the doctors decide that some patient requires bone marrow transplant they would search the database and find out that you may be the potential donor for a patient and in that case the registry would contact you and ask you whether you are willing to donate stem cell for a patient who requires an urgent bone marrow transplant like that you would non surgically donate your stem cell just like a simple process which is known as stem cell apheresis which does not require any surgery on you and after the stem cell apheresis the stem cells would be carried over to the center where the bone marrow transplant is being done and it would be infused to the patient again without any surgery one of the another lessons to learn in this story is that many people think that bone marrow transplant involves a lot of surgery the majority of bone marrow transplant especially which is done for cancers don't require any surgery it requires radiation or it requires chemotherapy followed by the stem cell infusion this is a complex process but the stem cell apheresis the stem cell donation which you will be doing is not a complex process which is a mostly a painless process so please take your mobile register yourself as stem cell donor and be a life saver for many of the patients with blood cancers